uh, one more sh short video on spherical mirrors, uh, relationship between the speed of object and speed of image. So let us say we have a concave mirror, just to explain, let us say this is a concave mirror and we have an object over here. Now this object forms sometimes a real image and sometimes a virtual image. Now let us take, let us say the object is moving around, so let us move the object. How will the image move? What is the speed of the movement, speed of the image when the speed of the object is this? So we will try to find a relationship between both of them. V0, VO rather, VO represents speed of the object and VI represents speed of the image. We will try to find a relationship between these two terms. Let us begin with the equation of mirror equation 1 upon V plus 1 upon U is equal to 1 upon F. V and U, as you know, are distances. This is the distance of the image, this is the distance of the object. Now, if you want to find out speed of the object and speed of the image, quite naturally we will differentiate them with reference to T. So, differentiate with respect to time T. So, differentiation of 1 upon V is minus 1 upon V square dV by dt minus 1 upon u square du by dt is equal to differentiation of f, f is constant for a given mirror, it does not change, so we have 0. Therefore, I will get 1 upon v square dv by dt is equal to minus 1 upon u square du by dt. Now, dv by dt is speed of the image, vi, and du by dt is speed of the object. So, I can put that over here. So, I will get 1 upon v square dv by dt is vi is equal to minus 1 upon u square du by dt is vo. And therefore, vi upon v0 is equal to minus v square upon u square or we can write this as vi is equal to minus v upon u whole square v0. So this is how, this is the relationship between the velocity of the image and the velocity of the object when the distances v and u are from, where these are the two distances from the pole of the mirror. Thank you.